let's do this. Let's see. Timer. Reset the timer. Boom. There we go. I feel like painting. No line art today, actually. Let's see what comes out. This feels like a, for some weird reason, a goblin face. So let's do a portrait. I do not know why it became a goblin, or why I saw a goblin, but it is what it is. My cat is a annoying princess, and she peed. Uh, on my wife's blanket this morning I don't know really why probably she doesn't like her litter box for some reason but yeah she pees on our beds if she's unhappy with her toilet state <laughs> I mean it is, we clean it all the time I think it's just very particular with smell. Uh, makes me think that maybe you need to buy more potent smelling, but you don't want your home to be smelling like a litter box, like a chemical litter box, and it can't be that fun for the cat either. Like, go to a perfume shop when you go to the toilet. So, I don't know, I've been washing blankets, we found also that the cat had peed in my daughter's bed, which is fun. We bought this um, uh, what's it called, UV lamp, that's like, spots cat pee. So we just switch off the lights and shine with stuff and we see where where she has done her business. It sounds like she's peeing everywhere all the time. She's definitely not, but on random occasions she becomes unhappy with some something and the cat just goes on a pee spree. <laughs> pee spree, that would be a fun tattoo to have. Maybe missing front teeth, that would be fun. I kind of want color today, and not this... Uh... Let's go color. For the sake of it, right? Uh, radiant map.
<laughs> this group is, has a good music. It's weird, kind of chill out rock, odd, oddness. It has a nice scent. Um, now and then, I tend to go like on YouTube um, search parties. I guess you could describe it as. I, I just, I let's say I put on a, a group that I like. And then I look at suggestions and listen to suggestions and keep on kind of traveling through YouTube until I find a great sounding uh, group. And then when I find a great sounding group, uh, I start the same journey again and kind of snowball through uh, YouTube. And then at some point, like I stop, but. Uh, in return, I, I have a new music. You know, I usually do it for like a couple of hours, just listening to music and, and clicking next thing and seeing where that leads me. Uh, usually, that gives me some cool new music, uh, especially that you just listen to what sounds good. Uh, many times, you uh, I uh, only find one good song from one. Group. But you know, that's fine. Hey, good morning, Grzeszko. Okay, Grzegorz Pe Pedric. <laughs> You're welcome, by the way. That's how you pronounce your name. Like a boss. Hello, Mr. Panka. How are you today? Today I'm playing with color for the sake of it. There's been a lot of monochromatic uh, things. I thought I'd, I'd, I'd paint some colors. And show another trick that I really, really love to do. Okay, the trick is posturize. And that's what posturize looks like. But we put it to color and go to around 22. Um. Uh, yeah, it's uh, orc style for sure. But you see what the posturize does, it breaks up colors into bats. Uh, and it's a really, for me, a fun way to get uh, a palette. Like all these subtle color shifts you can use to, to um, start sampling from. Because I sample a lot uh, from the canvas rather than uh, re uh, select new color. So I, I, I establish a palette and then uh, most most of the times just uh, stay within the canvas, like uh, the palette that's, that's there. I've been watching this Swedish TV show about uh, couples breaking up or not. Um, it's a really interesting to see. Like, there's these two guys who are do, do like funny shows most of the times. Like, they're not really like any serious people. They're like two somewhat young men. Uh, well, not middle-aged, and they're just kind of, I would not say stupid, but they're silly, you know, and, um, and they go around, uh, well, they state like they're no relationship experts, but they, 
they they just kind of ask them questions like normal people. Uh, it's not that, like Dr. Phil or anything like that at all. Uh, it's quite interesting to see. It makes you think about uh, how you treat other people, not necessarily like as in a negative way or like in a relationship or anything, but for me at least it makes me think how is actually things in life and so on, you know, on a deeper level than, than just in a shallow way. Which is, you know, it's always healthy to reflect and uh, makes, you, makes you think, you know, even though it's, it's all good. Because it never hurts to, to try a bit more, you know, to try to feel a bit more. I guess that's a good thing to say. Be aware of everything. Hmm. Stream is frozen again. How much time is it left? 18. Okay. What's the plan for today, people? Hey! Hello, Pat. Welcome. Good morning. Yeah, I did. I got myself a trim of the beard and a haircut. I have to do some public speaking at the end of the month. Uh, so, I have to be somewhat respectable, right? Cheers. Hello, new pathogen. Is that like a pathogen, like a virus? New pathogen? Or something else? <laughs> that's, that's a good reason too. Neopathogen or neopathogen. Uh, some cool sounding things are cool. You know? Hello, Hepizzle. <laughs> People and their internet handles. So funny.
to make that into a generic scar, you know. All orcs needs scar, right? Maybe he's even blind to go full on. Typical. You can't have a calm and loving orc or goblin, right? You need a this fun functional war ridden yeah everything <laughs> exactly Pat exactly he's like mother always told him don't run with scissors and then yeah I was battling this massive dragon with five heads. I killed them all. I downloaded them. Um, an artist's brushes the other day. Um, I uh, I had a look at them and uh, removed like seventy percent of them. Maybe I kept the ones that I found to be worth keeping for the time being. I know I have to go and delete some of them again as well, but. But, um, well, but um, it'll still stay for now. Experiment with it. I'm going to see if I find some. But I've already started finding it. Finding ones I want to keep. I like trying new brushes. Twelve minutes left. Almost dropped the pen there. It's not very good. Maybe I should have orange. Orange eye. Glowing. Or maybe the whole eye. But he smokes too much weed. Or liver issues. Nah. Maybe cold blue. That was pretty cool. Let's go with cold blue. his front teeth knocked out as well. Should be a bit more yellow, just for the sake of properly 
not caring about appearances. Let's do this. Ever slightly push back the hand. Let's go to see the chains. Mm, okay, that's okay. Eight more minutes. I wonder if I can like do full on top light or a little bit too much. Probably a little bit too much. Six more minutes. Hmm. Okay. Maybe time to add some um, personality. More personality. I mean, obviously, I've attempted to create a character, but let's give him some some stuff on him, right? I mean, obviously, his face is not very. It's quite generic, but, you know. Shot myself in the foot a bit in the beginning, but you know, I can't change it, or I won't have anything to show in end of the stream.
have always enjoyed giving like goblets and so on lots of um, jewelry and knickknacks and stupid things they don't really need just like they're like hoarders or goblin uh, or garbage collectors you know like they're they like crows they just love shiny things and piercings and I see goblins as, as crows more than uh, than trolls and orcs, you know. <laughs> yeah, definitely bad. It's always fun to do a goblin. It's a little bit, you're allowed to do whatever you want, right? Let's give him some fire as well. Three and a half. Chances that that makes it look like hair, hair, rather than fur. But oh well, doesn't matter. I just have to let the brush marks be. Yeah, goblins and Paul Bonner and. I love also, I mean, this is obviously not the orcs and goblins, but that French guy uh, that does uh, gnome, gnomes, uh, the name uh, eludes me, but some French guy, uh, like Jean-Baptiste or something like that. Uh, love his stuff. I mean, obviously, he's, he's a established, you know, gnome and trolls. Guy. He definitely knows his business. But he has crafted such a tangible universe, it's beautiful. Uh, I, do, I don't remember his name, so I can't really uh, recommend. John Bauer, yeah, I went to his. Uh, to his um, museum. Okay, one more minute, then I have to quit. Uh, could have a piercing, perhaps. There.
Okay, tick tock, tick tock, time is running out. Ah! Okay, I think I won't have any time to do anything more on it, this guy, than what I've done. That's it for today. Uh, thank you all for coming. Uh, have a good day, evening, good night, and uh, catch you wonderful people tomorrow. Bye.